Pirate Shalom, I'm gonna start off by giving all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shah, Ba'ashem, Raka Kodash. Double honors to the elder apostles and the elders of Great Millstone and GMS. And I want to say peace and blessings to the elect. Okay. Um, what you see on the screen here is what is called an RFID microchip. Okay. People are already taking these implants. Okay. And this is. What is this? What what the scriptures speak of as being the mark of the beast in Revelation chapter thirteen and verse sixteen? Okay. Now you have groups of Israelites. Okay, those that know that they're Israelites that are out there teaching that the mark of the beast is something contrary to this RFID microchip. Okay, this implantable device. Okay which allows you to buy, sell, amongst other things. And I'm going to bring the scripture out, okay? This is a Revelation 13, and I'm going to just get straight to the point. In 16, it says, And he calls it all, both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond, to receive a mark in their right hand or in their foreheads, and that no man might buy or sell, save he that had the mark or the name of the beast or the number of his name, Okay. Now, that word right there, Mark, in the 16th verse, goes back to a Greek word, which is karagma, okay? And it means to stamp, insert, cut, okay? And they're, they're already implanting this device in people, okay? First, they did with pets, you know, because they know how people have such a, a great attachment to their pets, it's like uh, uh, you let them tell it it's a member of the family, okay? So if Fido got it or little Fifi got it, okay, it's good enough for them since they one of the family, okay? Then, you know, it's good enough for us, okay? And it's it, all the things that come with it. Now, the point of me making this video is to give warning to our people, man, because it's a lot of Israelites that teach that the mark of the beast is something other than the RFID microchip, okay? Now, if you're teaching people that the mark of the beast is something else, you not only are going to get them put to death, but you also going to, their blood is going to be required at your hands, according to the scriptures, okay? So it's imperative that you teach the truth 100%. Part of that is that the mic, the mark of the beast is the microchip, okay? You know, um, a couple of things. One, I've heard uh, other Israelite camps saying, oh, y'all see the white man, he the one uh, say that the, the microchip is the mark of the beast. Okay, first and foremost, the Most High has pushed this out you know, that the truth came out on that, okay? And it ain't just so-called white people that say this, okay? I remember listening, just for an example, I remember listening to a song by Goody Mob, okay? And I believe the rapper's name was Big Gip, who is clearly a Jake, okay? Saying, no more fishing for your fish. Run your hand over the, over the scanner to pay for your dish. Something to that effect, okay? He was talking about being pl implanted with the... uh microchip okay and i'll say this a lot of those so-called white people that you think is white people because you're looking at them with a corn lie or jakes okay not saying they all are i'm just saying some of them are okay um but like i was saying um you have groups that'll uh, use that excuse, okay, and be like, oh, man, no, nah, y'all got that from the white man, man, you know. But it ain't just uh, so-called white people that's saying that the mark of the beast is the microchip, okay? Um, so I want to get a scripture real quick, and I just swipe. Right here in the book of Ezekiel, in the third chapter, okay? 
Because if you're teaching that the mark of the beast is something else, okay, we've, we, we've heard the other doctrines. Some say embargo. Some say it's Christianity. You know, that's all madness, man, okay? That word is karagma. It means to insert, okay, to implant, okay, to, put, to, to carve, to put, to, to, to put it, they going to put, they are putting, they already putting it in people, man. Okay? And as you saw on the screen prior, it says employees offered with RFID chip implants is voluntary for not. That's right. It's voluntary for not. Okay? And it's here. All right? So if you're teaching something contrary to that, the most high is going to jack you up, man. It's imperative that you, you speak the truth on this matter, okay? Because if you take that mark, all right, you're going to be destroyed, man, okay? Now, this is the book of Ezekiel, chapter 3, and verse uh, uh, six, 17. It says, Son of man, I, had made thee, I have made thee a watchman unto the house of Israel. Therefore... Hear the word in my mouth and give them warning from me. Okay? So the most high is set up watchmen. Okay? Those that know they Israel, they go out and they teach their people. But you got to teach them the truth, man. You can't go off on nothing. You got to be on point. Okay? Because going off on that one thing is going to get them put to death. And it's going to get you put to death according to the scriptures. And I'm about to read it. Okay? It says... And, man, we in that time, this is happening right now. This is happening, okay? So it's imperative that you, you speak the truth, okay? And it ain't no denying it. We're not making up these articles. This stuff in this worldwide, okay? We in that time, man. All right? So this is uh, Ezekiel 3 and 17, son of man, I have, I have made thee a watchman unto the house of Israel. Therefore, hear the word in my mouth and give them warning from me. Don't take the chip. Don't take the mark of the beast, man. Okay? It says, when I say unto the wicked, thou shalt surely die, because if you take that chip, you're going to get put to death. And thou givest him not warning, okay, nor speakest to warn the wicked from his wicked way, to save his life, the same wicked man shall die in his iniquity, but his blood will I require at thine hand. Okay? Because you ain't giving warning, man. You telling them to walk is something else. It says, yet if thou warn the wicked and he turn not from his wickedness, nor from his wicked way. Okay, so if you tell him it's the chip and he still take it with a hard head and a stiff neck. He shall die in his iniquity, but thou hast delivered thy soul. So you got to be teaching the truth, man. Okay? It's more than just waking up and knowing the fact that you're an Israelite, man. Okay? It's a lot more. This is one of the main, one of the imperative things along with the names of the Heavenly Father and other things. Okay? But I'm going to just stick to this. All right? So if you're teaching contrary that the mark of the beast is something else other than the microchip, man, you're going off, man. It's an implantable device, man, that they're going to use to track everybody, man. Okay? The scripture said you won't be able to buy or to sell. Okay? And it's happening. All right? So I just wanted to um, bring that out. I had another point, but it slipped my mind. It's just the spirit saying it need not be said. Okay, but um, again, I, I'm gonna end it right there, man. You got to, you got to tell our people the whole truth, man. Okay, you can't be off. Okay, because this will get them put to death and you. Okay, and that's a warning from the heavenly Father, man. Okay. So with that, I'm gonna give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shah, Ba'ashem. Raka Padash, double honors to the elder apostles and the elders of Great Millstone of GMS. And I'm going to say uh, peace and blessings to the elect. Okay. And until the next time, hey, before I even say that, don't take the mark of the beast, man.
it's the microchip. You get put to death. See, I got to keep saying, and that's going to be coming out more and more, man, because we in that time, man. Okay? So with that, I want to say, uh, Shalom.